And here is Mountain Echo. I'm going to have three on middle C and three on F, but I'll have finger two on the C sharp in my left hand. And my right hand finger two will play E. And that again means that your thumbs are in a bit of an or urban overcrowding situation. Just let them be relaxed. Um, they can hang wherever they need to hang. One, two, ready, go. This whole piece can be played with, this whole piece can almost be played with the relaxed arm drop. And it's really only here that you have to do an arm weight transfer where you're letting the arm behind finger three sort of align behind finger two to have an even tone there. But for the rest part, for the rest of it, you're just arm, wrist, wrist, relaxed wrist, arm drop, whatever you want to call it, relaxed arm drop. doing it. You just want just a relaxed arm drop and and a follow through. One, two, ready, go. In Suzuki piano lessons, they have a thing called the roll-up, where you have, instead of just pushing down on a long note, which doesn't do any good whatsoever, you play your long note and then gradually roll up out of it so that you're ready to play the next note. So I'll try to demonstrate that, and you can have a good watch here. Ready, go. those whole notes is to relax this arm muscle. Relax your upper arm muscle so that you're not pushing down into the keys unnecessarily. All right, good luck.